Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to the channel. Now in this video, I wanted to test not only how my CPU could run Breath of the Wild once, but how it could run the game in two separate instances at the same time using the same controller. As you can see on screen right now, I kind of struggled to play the game in synchronicity, so let's switch over to when I kind of got it synced up and see exactly how it went. You can also see my performance numbers up in the top of my CMU windows. It actually ran not too bad considering this is running in two instances. It is basically using every bit of my RAM and CPU resources, but surprisingly we didn't GPU cap. The highest GPU usage I saw in this use case was around 88-90%, to 90%, meaning that we still had a small bit of headroom for some GPU utilization. So everything looks good and synced up for now, but when we try to land on the Lake Hillia Bridge, you can kind of see that everything will just start to go wrong for me. The graphics preset I am also using in this video is a new Clarity GFX preset that I have been working on for the past 2-3 to three days. I'm trying to get the colours right between like brightness and dark areas, so let me guys know what you think of the visuals in this video down in the comments. I'm just going to let the rest of this video play out and you guys can enjoy the hilarity of trying to keep two links alive across two separate games using the same controller for both games.